safe area. agent has joined your team. Agent, it's Dr. Candle. I want to stress to you the vital importance of safeguarding any civilians you may come across. The math says some of those people must have survived the dollar flu. That means they've got antibodies to it that I need to have a hope in hell of fighting this thing. And the ones who are just sick, Having a broader genetic diversity of virus samples will help us track the virus's rate of mutation, which is a long way to say, keep those people alive until I get what I need from them. Got that? Great. Anyway, 
job done. are holding the entire tent city prisoner. That's what it looks like, and it fits the cleaner MO. If you wanted to eradicate every last vestige of detectable virus, where would you go? Wherever the biggest concentrations are. Refugee camps, shanty towns. Jesus, you don't think they... Draconian solution, but highly effective. Sure, if you're a genocidal maniac. You ever wonder if we even deserve to survive this thing? Every day, doctor. Every day. Good luck, agents. that agent you're walking into the teeth of it now don't forget what i said about keeping any infected refugees alive i mean obviously you're going to try and keep them all alive but i need those virus samples and i really need viable antibody samples from survivors so keep them extra alive i guess you know what i'm saying i'm going back to work now candle out Oh, my God. 
Confirmed. It's Napalm B, all right. With that much capacity, they must be planning to burn out the whole damn yard. And when they do, they're gonna kill every last refugee in that shanty town. We need that tank moved somewhere safe. Better. Better. What do you think the pipes are for?
an eye out over there. <laughs> My back! Okay, Agent. As soon as you lock the situation down, I've got a joint Sarah JTF strike force ready to move in. They'll take samples from as many refugees as they can find. Medical personnel? A couple of EMTs in the mix, Doctor. Yes. A couple? As in only two? The rest are first aid certified. They know how to tap a vein. Get going, Agent. Without contaminating the samples, I assume. Or infecting themselves, yes. I'll take your word for it. Thank you, Doctor. Get moving, Agent. Listen, 
I need you guys to log in to your info from everybody you get a sample from. Age, gender, ethnicity, general state of health on a 10-point scale. Then label and group the samples according to... Excuse me, doctor. But maybe this could wait until we get confirmation the op is actually complete. You saying you don't have faith in your agent? Just focusing on the task at hand. Lieutenant, we'll radio the doctor as soon as the area is secure. Yes, ma'am. Don't worry, Doctor. We'll get it all worked out. I hope so. This is the survival of the species we're talking about. Copy that, Doc. Patel, out.
Agent, if you can find the crane controls, drop that tank someplace safe. Team, listen up. Like I was saying, I'm gonna need those blood samples labeled and organized so we can track corroborating factors. Let's move this discussion to a different channel so we don't bore the agent. Mm -hmm. 
And these forced relocations, this dark zone, what is the point of that? We've already had a press conference on this. All the information is out there. Anything else is classified, and I can't comment. You're so you're sticking with the story that this is some kind of decontamination procedure? It's a delicate situation that we must take care of pragmatically. You should be close, Agent. The comparative data you secured from the train yard 